George Berkeley's Immaterialism, a deep dive into idealism. George Berkeley, an influential philosopher of the early modern period, revolutionized our understanding of reality with his theory of immaterialism. In this in-depth exploration, we embark on a journey through Berkeley's philosophical perspective, examining the essence of immaterialism, its implications for perception and existence, and its enduring significance in the history of philosophy. Join us as we unravel the complexities of immaterialism and its profound implications for our understanding of the world. Context and Background Born in 1685, George Berkeley emerged during a period of profound philosophical inquiry characterized by debates about the nature of reality, perception, and the mind. Against the backdrop of prevailing materialist and empiricist views, Berkeley developed his theory of immaterialism as a radical departure from traditional metaphysical assumptions. Drawing on his philosophical insights, Berkeley sought to challenge the prevailing materialist worldview and establish the primacy of mind in shaping our experience of reality. The Essence of Immaterialism At the heart of Berkeley's philosophy lies the rejection of material substance and the assertion of the primacy of ideas. Berkeley argues that physical objects such as tables, chairs, and trees do not exist independently of the mind. Instead, he contends that reality consists solely of perceptions and ideas, which are inherently subjective and dependent on the perceiving mind. In other words, to be is to be perceived, suggesting that the existence of objects is contingent upon their being perceived or thought of by a conscious observer. The Role of Perception Berkeley emphasizes the central role of perception in shaping our experience of reality. According to Berkeley, objects only exist insofar as they are perceived by a mind. For example, consider the perception of a tree. Its existence is contingent upon someone observing it or thinking about it. In Berkeley's view, the tree exists as an idea in the mind of the perceiver, rather than as an independent entity existing in the external world. This perspective challenges the notion of an external, mind-independent reality and underscores the subjectivity of human experience. Idealism versus Materialism Berkeley's immaterialism stands in stark contrast to the prevailing materialist worldview of his time. While materialists assert the existence of a physical world that exists independently of perception, Berkeley argues that reality is fundamentally mental in nature. Materialists posit the existence of material substance underlying the perceived world, whereas Berkeley contends that such substance is unnecessary and unsupported by evidence. For Berkeley, to be is to be perceived, suggesting that the material world derives its existence from the perceptions of conscious minds. The Problem of Realism One of the key challenges facing Berkeley's immaterialism is the problem of realism, namely how to account for the existence of objects when they are not being perceived. Berkeley addresses this challenge by invoking the notion of divine perception. According to Berkeley, objects continue to exist even when they are not being perceived by human minds because they are perceived by the omniscient mind of God. In other words, God's perception sustains the existence of objects in the universe, even in the absence of human perception. Implications for philosophy and beyond Berkeley's immaterialism has far-reaching implications for philosophy and our understanding of reality. By foregrounding the role of perception and consciousness in shaping our experience of the world, Berkeley challenges traditional metaphysical assumptions and invites us to reconsider the nature of existence. Moreover, Berkeley's emphasis on the primacy of ideas highlights the subjective nature of human knowledge and underscores the importance of critical reflection and introspection. Conclusion George Berkeley's theory of immaterialism offers a radical reimagining of reality, challenging conventional notions of material substance and external reality. Through his philosophical insights, Berkeley invites us to question the nature of existence and the role of perception in shaping our understanding of the world. As we navigate the complexities of human experience, Berkeley's immaterialism serves as a powerful reminder of the subjective nature of reality and the profound interplay between mind and world.